What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? We are continuing on with some more Chernobylite, y'all. I'm excited to keep going. Um, this is pretty much as uh, almost as far as we've gotten in the game um, prior uh, when we were streaming it before. Um, I feel like this is this game especially is working really well for episodic series. We can we've been able to pretty much knock out you know mission by mission by mission and have it pretty pretty good maintain decent decent times on the episodes so i am really getting pulled into the story more this time i think i was i was just kind of screwing around more the first time learning stuff um and the story is definitely grabbing me more the second time around so i'm gonna hop right back into it um i believe we are on day 11 i think the game pretty much forced us to die last night or the other in the other episode I think that was last night so it is morning of day 10 we are fully recovered so we don't need to stay Hello? back at the base Professor Kimanuk, Igor, uh, we covered Kimanuk. all of this dialogue in the prior episode so we're just gonna this skip a... through oh. all of this okay, just a second mouse it's been charging all day so it should be good to go it's been driving me nuts because with how i have it set up like the cord hangs off of the side of the desk and it pulls on the mouse sometimes so when i let go the mouse will move and it drives me nuts um let's see what we got here we have a bunch of revolver ammo we are not even carrying the revolver anymore um, so we could actually break all of that down. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. That'll allow us to make more ammo of what we're actually going to use. Which is the rifle and... I don't understand why it won't let us... I don't understand why it won't let us um, scrap these two. It's like it's forcing us to have those two and I don't want those two. Um, so let's make some shotgun slugs. Let's actually let's we'll make some more shotgun slugs as well so that'll top us up over here. All right, um, and we made the anti-Chernobylite burners with the uh, super oversized crafting station down there. Uh, that was that was kind of a sad bit. I was hoping to keep this upper level, like the crafting kind of station, maybe keep move uh, air purification and radiation bits down here like we did. Then have like the little growery over here, and this is where bros would uh, sleep. In fact. Speaking of sleep. Another bed. Uh, oh, this is a sofa. Okay, well, yeah, I guess this sofa can sit right here then because people don't actually have to physically be able to get to this I suppose uh, mechanical parts I want to see what else we can be building here uh, Chernobyl I, this is power supply air quality air quality is low can't do anything about that can't do nothing about that um, roller bending gas mask. No, I don't need that. The uh, the self offing chamber. We don't need that either. Uh, primitive armor. Force field generator. All right. We can't do nothing here, which is fine. Uh, for the moment, we're good. Let's go see what the day wants us to tackle. Um, actually, real fast here. Yeah, that'll work for me. My 
much better. Okay, so let's peek at the missions here. Um, we have Moscow Eye. This is a monster hunt. The voice in the Redwoods, that's the lady on the radio. Uh, the Pripyat Port. Um, man who worked for Tarakan. Okay, yeah, so that's a uh, douchebag from the other episode. Uh, damn, you know, Monster Hunt and Kopachi and all Olivier's got a 99% chance to knock that out. Let's go ahead and send him on that Monster Hunt because he's a fucking badass. Suppose we can send Mikhail on a munitions drop and that just leaves us. Um, we might go on a monster hunt as well. I think we're gonna go knock out for this episode the Moscow Eye, because I'm pretty sure there's an anti Chernobylite spot and I would like to loot all of those. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Um, I don't think there's any sort of time limit on the main quests. So, let's go ahead and knock that out. Stoked. Super stoked, man. We're going to be doing the monster hunting. Yeah. Alright, uh, let's peep on the map here. A bunch of question mark spots. That's what we gotta go nab up. We have three Chernobylite burners. I'm pretty sure this is a spot for the burner. Um, but there's things to loot. We're looking for chemicals the most at the moment, so we'll keep our eyes open for that. Damn, there's a lot of stuff to loot now. I wonder if that has anything to do with the fact that our, our character was forced to die. I wonder if that's what causes what causes things everywhere to respawn and the maps to reset when you die and change events and whatnot. Um, that's very that's very possible. What's up, big kitty? He's been quite the talker lately, and I know I know. It, it, it gets me worried sometimes. He's always, he's always, oh shit, uh, uh, he's always been a talker, but. Um, yeah, how do we, do we need to get out of this, this spot here? It does worry me sometimes though, because I know cats will also communicate, being like, they'll, they'll communicate to say something is wrong. Am I not? Am I not actually being negatively affected by the radiation, other than the the one bar of health loss? Oh, we didn't make any lock picks. That's what. Well, we need chemicals though, so um, yeah, we'll have to come back for those. hearing the Tanya thing. Oh, we're not even heading in the right direction here. Drew, uh, rifle on one, shoddy on two, perfect. Yeah, the con the, I've been wanting to redo the controls for a little bit with the weapons and whatnot, because it's been kind of driving me nuts. I was just getting seen by something. Dude over there. Yeah, that extended range is extremely I nice. Some cup of coffee. I like I it. With brandy. No, I'm crouched, dude. Blocking my mushrooms, bro. I need those. Can you 
Fuck off. Bush, you can't see me. Before these other dudes come by. Come on, dude. Why can you not keep moving? The building we want is over here, though. Yeah, it was nice getting that, that last training for the parts, getting more resources. That's definitely going to be helping us out. How do we get in this damn building? Kid boy. Oh, fuck you, dude. I ain't going nowhere. I'll wreck all of you. Give me all that loot, bud. Damn, wasted all of them. Let's go. Damn, I took this guy's arm off. Yeah. Wild. Oh, fuck that guy up, dude. Damn. That's pretty brutal. Oh, I missed one. How are we getting into this building then? Oh, right here. Who? Oh, it's you. So, this is how you get your goods, huh? Gordon Gecko, my ass. Wait, oh snap. It's not like that. Don't bullshit me. I heard the gunshot. I'm not a murderer. You have to believe me. This dude was already a goner. I just I put him out of his misery. It was mercy. You could I have tried to help him. him instead. I wonder how your other customers will react to this. Or maybe you just shoot them too. Well, no, of course not. I just look out here. You need to take opportunities whenever you see them. Otherwise, you'll never make it. Let's How about you it. forget you saw me, and next time, I might have something extra for you. Done my share of questionable things. I won't be casting stones. If I'm turning a blind eye, I might as well get paid. Yeah. No. Give me everything you have on you and get lost. What? You're out of your goddamn mind. You know how long it took me to get all of this? You said it yourself. You need to take every opportunity you can. 
Call one of your friends in high places if you have a problem with it. Fucking fine. Take it all. I was gonna leave this godforsaken city of ghosts anyway. There you go. Yeah, what, what, what you got for us? Hanging or maybe you know something about Tanya. Exchange gear for food, exchange food All right. for gear. Show me what you've got, Mr. Yeah, and he still he gives us everything he's got and he still trades for us. Alright, um One ceramic plate. I think I've done enough trip. I'm looking to used to work at the power plant. She went missing. Uh, I'm sorry, my friend. It's been a while since I've seen a woman. Yeah, I've no, this conversation busy. wouldn't busy? continue after what we With just pulled. We've created a new app. Good luck. Yeah, that's the Gordon Gecko bit. Gordon Gecko, my ass. Good luck building your fortune. <laughs> Alright, so is that what we were discovering was the Vagabond there? Alright, but let's move on, get out of here. I'll move on over to this building now. Like I get, I, I'll see one shiny, and then it's like, oh, there's <laughs> another shiny. My sweet Tanya, I can never tell if you're coming or going. So unpredictable, so oh, alive. You teased me out of my shell. <laughs> Damn! Look <laughs> at all the shiny. the turtle. Remember the fairy tale? I do. Except I would never outrun you. Not in a million years. <laughs> well, don't lose hope, my love. <laughs> I believe in you. Get, I need to get all of these parts and stuff, guys. I'm pretty sure that's got to be what it is, because we've come to this area multiple times, and I was looking around last time. There was nothing to discover. We looted everything. And then now all of a sudden there's more stuff here. So that's, that's got to be what it is. And now we're, we're really stocking up on some parts now. There's another another bro. Uh, What's up, Simon? Good to see you, Grigor. My brother in arms. Um, Grigor. Wanna trade some stuff? I'd like to exchange a book. Uh, get five chemicals for four rifle for bullets. Five mechanical parts for the revolver bullets. Yeah. Um. I'm not willing to trade that. Exchange ammo for gear. Yeah, no, he just wants to take my ammo. Okay. Don't want to jump down because our character is a post plus. She can't even handle a fall from that height. Oh, hey, what's up? This is the uh, locksmith, but I don't believe he'll give us any more lockpicks. Hello, fellow prospector. Can we... Can we trade again? Uh, food rations... Do you have any... Hot... I thought you would never... So, get one lockpick for two food rations. Alright. Uh, one ceramic plate for a food ration. Nah, we'll we'll go ahead and back out of that. Exchange Let's see what you've got, pal. For resources, electronic parts, herbs, mushrooms. Yeah, I'll take that. Safe travels, my friend. Yep, thanks, bud. Um, all right, so that's the dude to discover here, but. There's all kinds of lootable stuff in here, so we're just gonna run through real quick and uh, nab all of this up. 
especially chemicals. We need chemicals real bad. We need chemicals to make a lot of different stuff. The mushroom. Alright, uh, door use. Yes. Uh, nothing in here. Let's head back. There's up. Mechanical parts. Flammable stuffs. That, grab that. All the important goodies. Yo, the extended range is absolutely insane. I feel like I can see almost everything on the map. It's it's almost a little confusing. Um, I think we might be done here. There is a Chernobylite burn over there, though. Which means loot. Um, yeah, there's nothing else in this building. Distracted by run, wanting to run around for all the loot. Mushrooms, need the mechanical parts. Like we need all of this stuff, so. Get it. We have something shiny up there as well. Off of this guy. Now it's your turn. Got me. Now it's your turn. Oh, oh, oh. creepy. Yeah. There we go. Anti Chernobylite burner. How do we? down here three Chernobylite all right bet got anything else down here crafting station I can make the okay it's the forge and furnace I'll craft one of those Yo, I feel like this is one of the places we should be, should have been coming for like the main quest here. Three Chernobylite though, that's pretty, that's pretty fat stack right there. That's worth it. It's a little difficult to traverse, but that's not it's not too bad. Right, we're almost we're almost clear with it. Oh, 
My psyche is pretty low right now. Get it, hit them bars, bro. Damn, that's what's up. Yo, you got them them bars right there. Can you hear me now? Take all your stuff. Set up for when this guy comes back around on his journey, yeah. Oh shit, yeah, there he is. Yeah, mediated like a motherfucker over here. Yeah. We would wait for him to do his loop here. Maybe. Maybe it looks like he's gonna go... Like chilling right through all of it though. That's crazy. He probably didn't even know. Oh hey, we got a rifle we could break down. What happened to the mushrooms? We grabbed the mushrooms then, yeah. I suppose I don't really have to worry about radiation then, huh? There, so shit. Who's, who's peeping? Mm. Oh, this guy's peeping. Ah, uh, what a day. What a shitty, shitty day. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Definitely a shitty day. Too quick for your boy. Too quick for your boy. Let's get it. Give me all shit. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Fucking yoink, boy! Alright, um, figuring out how to get up there. Ooh, hello. Hello, it's your noble light for daddy, yeah? A revolver for me to break down, sweet. go to Chernobylite here. Bunch of revolver ammo that I could be trading to dude, I guess. And two more right here for Chernobylite. Very good, very good. Oh, 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 I hear the bro. What up? You stopped bugging the, the dudes, huh? 
Hey, yo. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. A hunter went out for a walk. Suddenly a hare appeared and shot him down. Bang, bang, bang. The hunter is going to die. He was crawling back home saying, bury me low and let me lie. <laughs> Yo, what? Yo, Bradfa, bro. Stop right there. You're on Pripyat, Brad. You mentioned what kind of what about this? Uh... That'll be one. One food ration. Sure Here thing. you go. Here you go. It's just. Thank you. Uh, your inventory is full. New items were dropped on the ground. Uh oh. I better be going now. Yeah, Bradf we better be going. A box of loot. Yeah. Let's see. Um. Damn, we picked up a pretty calibrated one here, huh? Let's remove that, I guess. we're gonna I guess we're kind of limited on our inventory space at the moment I hadn't ever really reached that being a problem All right, we got some more lootables up in here we'll grab everything that we can grab though guys uh, we be needing it you know what I'm saying Excellent. What you got for me up here? I see you. I see you hiding something up there, bud. I see it shining. What you got for me? Is this a clue? A note. Can't sleep, my love. Are you worried hey. about tomorrow's exams? I've got a feeling something terrible is going to happen. I'm scared, Igor. Hey, everything's going to be fine. Dr. Petrovich is one of the best gynecologists in the country. Well, and we're in this together. Remember? The fuck? I hope you don't come to regret that, my love. Yeah. Uh, Gaina. In Gaina. Alright, um, here we go. Here's the stairs for this building. Sneak up, nab that, nab that. Some over here. Creepy doll after. That's okay. Everything here in this building, excuse me, let me out, thank you. Alright, so all we got left is to let's go hunt off a monster. Um, I think we got we got that already. We did not loot this guy. Two point six, absolutely.
that was a little tougher. We should have been using our armor. We weren't using the armor. Overgrown duster. Hey! Yeah. That's that's my job. I dust people, dude. Damn. All right. Um. Fucking health is like definitely messed up, though. Yeah, let's go ahead and heal up here. Um, also go ahead. I seen that we picked up some sips off of somebody. There we go. Prove our psyche. Excellent. And now we'll go back to base. Perfect. Excellent. Look at us. We're getting more efficient with this, guys. Picking up more resources, getting shit done quick. We just went in, we just popped some foes. What'd you get? Three Chernobylite? Let's go. I picked up a bunch of that shit myself. He got the rifle ammo. Hey, let's go. He picked up the right ammo, guys. Um. Yep. We're going to go ahead and do that. Well, we have stored produce, so you know what? Double food ration for everybody. Well, except for except for me, because I don't need it, I guess. All right, yo. Um, things we're going to want to do here. Let's break down this AK. We do not need that. We do not need that. I'll keep those on us. Alright, bet. So the first thing I'm going to want to do is come over. Five of those. for chemicals. Uh, that did help us get all squared away with what we need. This, let's see here. Yeah, we're all upgraded with the shotgun here. I wish I could, um, See that draw increasing the mag it decreases the damage and I want my shoddy to be just like 100% powerful so like I, I went for as much power as I could gain on this oh wait no I didn't you see here it gives us an extra for reduction goes down. No, we'll, uh, I think uh, I think we got it where yeah, good where we're at for that. Um, let's see. We want radiation security. Damn. All right. All right. So yeah, definitely need the chemicals. Um, how about air quality? Can we do anything with that? We can. Perfect. Let's come over to... No, nothing in these. That is unfortunate. Alright, I wanted to build the... Of course, we're slacking in that. Um, yep. Let's see here, mechanical parts and the flammable parts though. There we go. Right. 
So let us deposit all of our goodies now. out of here we'll make this our our doodads for ammo and whatnot want to stock up on the rifle ammo here so here max of 30 of something that makes that actually makes sense. Oh, uh, that could work for me. How do I unlock more inventory space, though? Um... I think I gotta train with Mikhail for that. Is that what it was? Where, where the creeper at? Where is this guy? Mikhail, where are you hiding, sir? Oh, there you are. You're over there by the couch. He's claimed to. You couch. have a second, Igor. What's up? I was just thinking about my friends, Zina, Yuri, Ludmila, and Igor. Your namesake. They were the best fucking guys and gals I've ever known. When I first arrived, I was lost, just stumbling around in the dark like an idiot. They took Still me in is. and we became inseparable. The greatest team of stalkers the world has ever seen, will ever see. They called us the Pripyat Five. It was a stupid ass joke, of course, but I still liked it. Zeno was the smart one. Whatever the problem, she always had a solution in her back pocket. She could get us out of every kind of goddamn mess. Except Yuri the one that got her killed. the strongest guy ever. He was our shield. It was like he was carved from wood. Igor was the leader. But really, he was like the older brother I never had. And then there was Ludmila, the party girl. We did so many drugs together. I had a bit of a crush on her, and I think it was mutual. Shit. I'm really <laughs> sorry. Shit. <laughs> the realization this place we built it together carried all this shit on our backs like fucking ants I never worked so hard in my life it was supposed to be our post apocalyptic hive the Pripyat fucking five in the hive my homies my home I'm really sorry Mikhail I hope you can at least find some closure here all right, yeah, but enough depressing shit. Train me, dude. I'm Mikhail, pretty sure you are not. You've been around. You could teach me something about survival. Caps of fucking lootly are gathering in for. All right, uh, perfect survival instinct capacity. Yeah, gain 12 more inventory slots. Perfect. Let's go ahead and gain that. Since we're picking up more stuff now, we're gonna need more slots. I feel like that's gonna be essential. Listen up, hey, Buttercup. What's this? There are many different skills you need to master to survive in the zone. Sneaking, well, you have a spying, head. wheeling and dealing, stealing, eavesdropping, door guiding. Door guiding? Have you got a yeah. problem with that? Guiding clueless Westerners in search of cheap thrills is an honest and, more importantly, lucrative business. But stop interrupting. Where was I? <laughs> Surviving in the zone? Ah, yes. Among the many skills a man needs in the field, one is particularly important for a noob like yourself. <laughs> Would you like to guess what it is? Wouldn't dream of it. In that case, a noob. I'll tell you. It's the art of packing shit better so you can carry more shit around. You don't look impressed. 
I know it doesn't sound as exciting as jumping from helicopters or fighting ten opponents using nothing but your flying feet of fury. That crap is the special purview of our favorite soldier boy, Olivier. But imagine you have to smuggle three crates of your best rotka to an NAR checkpoint, and you only have space for one in your inventory. And why? Because you didn't pay attention when I was giving you some invaluable fucking lessons about packing. And now you ruined somebody's wedding. Talks all kinds of shit. Because there's not enough booze, and it's all your fucking fault. I, I'm sorry. I'm but it's not sorry? too late to avert this catastrophe. Don't worry, the Premier Five have got your back. I mean, I've got your back. Just watch me arrange chemical, scrap metal, ammunition, and mask filters like a 3D puzzle. If you run into any problems, I will be your tour guide. I mean, guide. Great. Looks like you're ready to <laughs> save that wedding. Yeah, now. he's all over the place. Okay, so what what are we doing? That was it. All right, cool. Um, I don't have to do anything for that. That's amazing. Why can't they all be like that? All right, new capacity. All right, so we got 12 extra slots. Let's scoot everything over then. That works nicely. Alrighty, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and head to sleep for the night, and that's gonna be the episode. Appreciate everybody for stopping through. I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure you smash that like button for me if you guys made it this far and have not done so already. I really appreciate the support. It helps the channel out and helps the content get pushed out to more audiences so more people can see the greatness. So we appreciate you. Thank you so much. And we'll catch you in the next one. Peace out, guys.